The northwest of England is lauded as a cycling powerhouse. I'm chasing Strava, forget it. There's some quality bike riders around here, and they take those for fun. Spanning four counties with landscapes unique and challenging. That's a good idea. I hope they've got one on the top as well. The ultimate training ground. You've got the best facilities in the world at the velodrome, and then roads like these to train on. For some of the world's greatest cyclists. How many Olympics is that now? Seven. <laughs> place with a strong heritage. You've got people who have been coming here since before I was born. Why are you still coming? Just shrine to cycling, isn't it? And an even stronger future. And here it is, probably the most advanced bike in the world. So what makes the northwest of England a heartland? Well, it's a beautiful part of the world to ride a bike. The roads are pretty quiet, plenty of tough hills. There's nowhere to hide on a slope like this. There's certainly no slipstream, is there? Well, that's right. As you can see, you've got flat, you've got hills, you've got a velodrome and gold medalists to train with. It's a multi-eventer's dream, really. I've got all the different types of roads I could ever need to get fit and hone my skills. You seem to have been climbing now for about three hours. Yeah, this is the There's got to be a cafe somewhere around here. <laughs> got your own oven. I have an oven. Here's one I baked earlier. You've got two kids now and you're still just as competitive. Why haven't you gone stale like the rest of us? I think I've always just loved being competitive, so I'm quite happy to keep, keep pushing on. We'll pick up yeah. just after one of us has a heart attack. 